Hey guys, how are you all doing? So today I'm here to talk about photo coloring. If you're a photographer, you've probably heard of this term before. But if you haven't, don't worry because this is what we'll be talking about today. So what is photo coloring? So you know when you go to a shoot and end up clicking 5,000 images and only 1,000 are to be delivered to a client, the process of selecting and sorting through those images is photo coloring. Now why is photo coloring important? It's actually an essential part of your post-production process which leaves a direct impression of your work and your brand on the clients. And of course, it helps with the storage. Coming to what's the best way of culling photos. Now, there are various ways of culling your photos, both AI and manually, or sometimes even outsourcing it. But my preferred way would be using an AI photo culling software like FilterPixel. So let me show you how I do it. So I import my photos into FilterPixel and let it do all the heavy lifting for me. What it does is it automatically categorizes all my photos and gallery into accepted, rejected and duplicates. In fact, it even goes and tags them as closed eyes or blurry. Now all I have to do is review the selections made by FilterPixel and then directly export to Lightroom. And that's it, we're all done. Photo coloring might seem like a tedious task, but FilterPixel makes it a whole lot more easier. Now that's all I had for today's video. I hope you learned something new about photo coloring.